Hello anyone, Mr. Skyson here and welcome back to more A Whole New World. Last time we saw an enemy of my own design, that was pretty fun, looked awesome, fought well, just an all around great enemy, it was a good time. Also we traveled the dark below as we made our way through the tunnels dug out by the evil forces, that was cool too, I guess. Today we return to the castle where it all started and face off against the evil ones, let's go. Falling through the hole again. Deja vu. And hi. Ow. I needed that face. You jerk. You just be glad that I've got infinite lives. And that I can attack you from below. Ha <laughs> ha. You didn't see that coming, did you? And whoever was above you? I think it was one of the little imp things. Very annoying. Little hi, me. Still like how it, how it came out. My original design for it was just some, uh, just some rough sketches. Because I don't art well. But I really like how he turned out in the end. Yes, I know I'm self-congratulating on that a lot, but I like how he turned out, darn it. They did some really nice pixel work on that. Or sprite work? However you want to count it. Both. Oh, we got a bunch of guys above me. Ooh, ooh. I just want to see if I can do something. Hey, can I hit you? Yes, I can, and holy crap. I startled you. You ran away. Pew pew. Oh, two of you. Or is it a couple? Yeah, it's a couple of dueling knights up there. Neat. And now they're dead. Cool. I cheated the system. I cheated the system. Whee! I like that I get an after image of sorts, like a shadow going on. Do I get it when I'm in other forms? Yes, I do. Okay, then. Cool. Hey, there's chicken that I could have used before dying. Yep. No, you don't. No, you don't. You stop that right now, mister. Oh, hey, he stopped that. Cool. That guy's all right. So if I recall, oh, okay then, I'm remembering that there used to be images that would pop up in the walls in this area, like custom tiles designed by some of the Kickstarter backers, but apparently those were removed, or perhaps they are elsewhere. Maybe they come up in New Game Plus mode, I'm not entirely sure. Hmm. I remember them seeing during testing, I just don't seem to find them now. Because I've gone into a few rooms now and nothing. Hooey! Slidey powers activate and holy crap. So yeah, there's uh there's the outside world. Everything's all black and red and ominous and broody and uh giant black particle effects coming out of the ground. I don't think that's normal. I don't think the planet is supposed to behave that way. Pretty sure somebody needs to fix that. Yep. Because I'm pretty sure that it didn't always look that way. I I feel very strongly that it used to look a lot different. No, you don't. Maybe you do. Yep. Oh, nope. Okay. What you gonna do now? You gonna die? Cool. Awesome. I like it when the little imp guys die. Hi again, me. Eh, you. There we go. Hi, me. And... Whoa, okay, yeah, I forgot. I've got moves. Holy crap, I'm fast. That's why I designed him the way I did. He's supposed to be a bit more of a challenge. He's supposed to be super annoying when you're fighting him. And he looks really cool with the after image. And back of the head. And I'm sitting on your side. That's cool. Yeah, you get a lot of the, especially here in the late game, you get a lot of the after image, that black effect. Like, you'll see it here with this guy. He throws the axes. You get the after image going on. Not a fan of how it turned out with the axes, but I like it with pretty much everybody else. Like my sliding effect, some of the other enemies, like the spear guy, it looked all right. And of course, Nessix, it works really well because he's like the whole specter thing. So you expect that kind of thing from a specter. Hi there. Looks pretty all right with him too. It's like he's going fast and you're like, holy crap, he's got after images. But I don't know. I just never really felt it all that well with the axes. Yeah, no custom tiles in any of the rooms. I'm really curious why. But onward to Prius. He returns. And holy nutballs, this is a tough fight. Like during testing, I died. Oh, so many times. Did I just, holy crap. Oh, no, there it is. Double jump, ha ha. Holy crap, he actually didn't hit me with the sparks. But yeah, that is, oh, what are you doing, guy? 
Ow, okay. I thought you were going to do something else with that attack. Yeah, I thought you were going to be doing this. So yeah, in this fight, he is considerably more difficult than he was starting out because he has all of the powers from all of the previous bosses. And that's just awesome. Plus his own. Though oddly, he doesn't really use that attack quite as much. Whoop. And I believe he even still shoots out the, the little goopy guy. But again, not... Ah, uh, darn it. Not very often. Oh. But he loves doing... Ow, why did I jump? He loves doing this attack. And this attack will wreck you. Final one. And then he slides. Ah. Very difficult. Okay. Ba blam And now you die. Crumble and weep before me. Love that animation. I always felt like this went on a little bit long with the flashing and such. But that is a really cool death animation. He's like, no, I've been defeated. That's just really cool looking. Really good work on that, guys. It's the chicken goddess. Grant me chicken. Oh. It's alive. Chicken goddess. Oh, I, I, I needed chicken. I'm almost dead. Okay. The goddess giveth chicken. The goddess giveth... No chicken. I can deal. I have infinite lives anyway. But still, I am kind of hungry. Chicken would have been lovely. I mean, I've been fighting enemies for a very long time now. Something to eat would be nice. Yes, I know, I just raided the pantry earlier, getting those three pieces of chicken, but hey. Oh, hey, chicken. Cool. Thank you, chicken goddess. You gave the illusion of no chicken when suddenly chicken. This is a good day indeed. And what's up here? Chicken! Holy crap, full health. Awesome. And now we have the final boss fight ahead. But... Oh, just noticed my score. 200, 300. Very nice. But... I'm gonna go ahead and leave it here a little bit early. Because this fight... is a bit tougher, and I don't know how long it would take me. So I'm actually going to split this into two parts. Because we are right here at the end. But this one's a bit of a doozy. I somehow made the Prius fight look easier. I didn't die for a change. Like, normally I die at least a couple of times against him. But this time, came out with at least one heart. That's pretty awesome. But yeah, next time, we beat the crap out of a big boss. And that's going to be so much fun. But anywho, this has been a whole new world. I hope you've enjoyed watching. If you did, then give the like button a tap. And if you want to see more like this or more from me, then give the subscribe button a big thumbs up. I will see you all next time, and remember to stay groovy.